I have some papers for her to sign. Oh, yeah, I bet you do. Um, well, if, if you hurry, you could probably catch them. Her attorney is still with her. You two find a name yet? How about victim? Because with you as parents, that's what it'll be. This child winds up with... I won't have anything to do with choosing it. Well, I think no, this is important. I... I've signed away any claim to this kid. What? It's the only solution. I don't want Emily to have this baby, but she's going to have it. And the only way that I can distance myself is to relinquish paternity. Paul, I... I've already signed the papers. Dusty, you have something to say? I guarantee you and Emily will be raising that kid side by side before the year's out. Celebrating. <sighs> Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. What are you doing here, Susan? Cleaning out drawers. For you, I presume. The rest of Emily's things. Oh. Uh, did you find it all? Uh, it's hard to tell. Everything changed for Emily here. Her clothes, the books she read, even what she bought at the drugstore. I wouldn't be surprised if I take this stuff to the hospital and Emily looks at it as if she never saw it before. As if it belonged to somebody else, because it does. A hospital? Oh, that's right, you don't know. Emily uh, was committed to the psych ward for evaluation. She's not being arraigned? <laughs> no. The judge thought that she needed help before she needed any punishment. Oh, I'm sorry if that's a buzzkill for you and Paul. You can't tell much from that. It's not yet. Well, you <clears throat> must be able to tell something. You have to know how to look, what to look for. I can see that that's my child in there. I, uh, brought the divorce papers. I, um, you know, I, I didn't, I didn't want to just dump them here and then, and then leave. Sign him now if you want. I'm gonna get a pen. All you gotta do is sign and Pretty simple, right? Jill house wedding only lasted a couple of days. All we have to do is erase those couple of days. Yep. At least on paper. It's 
three. I'm surprised to see you here. It's only observation. You must be relieved. Uh, don't worry. I'm going to be locked up, okay? Either here or in jail. Don't, don't worry like about it. Come on. You okay? Why do you ask? Really, you don't have to, you know, go through the motions of asking about me, pretending you care. I'm not. I really want you to get better. I will. And this is a good start. Where are the other ones? What other ones? The other papers. Giving up your rights to my baby. Don't you have them too? I want a whole and healthy daughter again. Paul has twisted her in so many ways that it's a miracle she didn't, she didn't break before this. Oh, so this is all Paul's fault? He made her do these terrible things? You know he did. He used you too. Emily is a sick woman. Paul didn't create that. No, but he used it, didn't he? To get what he wanted at the time. Now he's gonna be here tonight, celebrating, drinking champagne, while my daughter sits in the psych ward, wondering if she's ever gonna get to raise the baby she's carrying. Does that sound right to you? A little distracted yeah, today. Yeah, I know the feeling, trust me. So do you have the relinquishment papers? Jessica will have them soon. Soon? In a couple days. What's the delay? I, I, I don't know. So you were wrong. This, this is not over. I'm really sorry, yeah. No, you said you wanted this to be over. The sooner the better. This was your idea. This whole thing. You couldn't wait to be separated, officially separated from me and my baby. I don't know why uh, the divorce papers are here and everything else took longer. I, maybe, maybe the family court takes a few days, you know, because the decision is so So wait, 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 what are you saying? You have to come back now? Well, I can have them sent by messenger if that's what you want. I want, I want this to be over, just like you do. But there's nothing I can do to make that happen. Only you can, it's your job. So please just get it done. You honestly think Emily should be having a baby right now? What I honestly think is that her husband who didn't love her, shouldn't have slept with her. And if she wants to have this baby, I can't judge her for it. And, and you'd be happy to raise it? Oh, yes. And I'm happy to know that that baby will never have to know what a rotten father I had. <sighs> you know, you just can't give him credit for doing the right thing, can you? I mean, he's doing what you and Emily and everybody wants, and still you find a way to, to hate him for it. I hate that whatever Paul does, he never has to pay the price. Because for some reason, he's always able to convince some woman to take care of him and to take the fall for him. That's not true. Oh, no? He had you standing by while my daughter's clothes were still hanging in the closets. By the way, you can tell Emma to give me a call when it's time to clean your things out of here. I mean to make things harder for you, Emma. I'm trying to look forward. When I think about carrying this baby, I feel better. I feel like there's hope in my life for the first time since New Year's. Well, that's great. I want a life without you. Whatever life that is, just me and my baby. That's what you want, right? I want nothing but what's best for you, truly. Okay, so that means I go my way, you go your way. We cut all ties. You give up your right to this child, legally, permanently. I'll, um, 
I'll send you the papers as soon as Jessica gets them back. You take care of yourself. No furniture suite you had booked at the state You're pen. here. Oh. Yeah, Mary. How did you get in? Well. Do Dr. Felicia Goldberg? Yeah. Well, they don't look at the pictures too closely around uh, here. Thank goodness. 